you so much for coming. I mean, I grew up watching you on Generations. You are still <laughs> on television, you know, Mama Hi. Zala. Now it's music. Just talk us through the journey. The journey is. It's been amazing. Um, God has blessed me. Mm. I can't complain. A lot of people have been complaining about COVID and you're yeah, good. Mm. Yeah. But uh, instead of me having little, I have, I think I've been blessed with more. Mm. So it's been a, a fruitful journey. Um, very difficult, very painful, very stressful, which is why now I'm a piano. Because mm. I'm a piano at least is now stress relieving. Okay, so also you've been a TikTok sensation. Hey! <laughs> hey, you are now. Tell us more about that. What's going on? You're a TikTok guy. You've been doing the most there. Hey, no, thank you. I'm going to drink. TikTok is amazing. TikTok <laughs> just. I, I discovered TikTok late. I'm going to get into the late, man. Mm, yeah. So I discovered TikTok, TikTok late, and it's nice, man. You know, I don't like. I like positivity in my life. Yeah. And all the videos, the videos that I've seen of you. Hey. <laughs> hey. Hey. Not me. So, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> so everything that I've been seeing on TikTok is nice, um, refreshing, positive. I don't like videos of people with blood and stuff. So yeah. uh, TikTok has been has been very entertaining to me. Yeah, you're an actor, presenter, musician. Which one is your favorite? Artist. Yeah, oh, come through. Love with it. it. Love now it. still on Ama Piano. Why? Why am I piano? Why? Look, now I've been explaining this to everybody who's been calling me. I grew up as a gospel singer. Yes. Clap and tap, but a Yes, yes, yes. That's yes, where yes. I grew up. Mm. And then I went to um, SWE Secondary School in Katlehong. I had a group called Pause. You know, stop, play, pause. Mm. That is the name of the group. Why we say our words? That was the name of the group. We were four guys. Grew up. We actually went to Shell Road to Fame and all those things. Um, grew up. Varsity, I joined other guys. I ended up actually we had an album, mm. Afro Pop, uh, Sierra Quadra no Spokes Age, the late Spokes Age. Oh wow! But the deal we were getting from Spokes Age was not a deal that we could go with. So we said no, we're not gonna sign the deal. Sabayega was a yega ya hamba. Then I loved house music. I grew up plus pam gua pam duma silela atama fukate. But I was more on the house music side. I loved it. My piano. It's just an authentic South African sound. But why do you feel like now is the right time yeah. for you to get into music? Because I have done all since 2000, since 1998. You am cookie Since 1998 <laughs> till 2000 and last year, mm. everything that I've been doing, more especially on the presenting side, mm. was for other people. I was helping speak out. I was helping other people. Mama Zala, your yep. mom's show. I, I'm helping other people. Beautiful. Now my piano is for me, guys. Oh, you're doing something for yourself. My piano, for, for once. Yes. For once, yes. I'm doing something for Beautiful. me. Beautiful. Yeah. Exactly. We spoke off air about, you know, your longevity in the industry. What yes. advice would you give to young broadcasters or artists in general? It's very important for you to do something because you love it. Mm -hmm. Not because you think you're going to be rich tomorrow or you you see I was this lonely. You, it's, it's very important to do something because you're not chasing money, but you're chasing the love for it. Mm -hmm.